All right, guys, today we got here a brand new tablet from Huawei. It's called the MatePad 11.5, and it's designed to be compact, lightweight, slim, allows you to do your work as well as entertainment on the go. It comes with this really awesome paper matte display, anti-glare, and more importantly, I think the cool part about this is that it's only RM1599 here in Malaysia. Now for this RM1599, you know, what you're actually getting is not just a tablet, but you also get a detachable keyboard case, you in fact also get the stylus, which is called the M Pencil 3rd Gen in the mix. So the bundle itself is very impressive. Again, for RM1599, it's pretty difficult to find a sweet deal like this. But yeah, let's talk a bit about what you can actually use and do on the Huawei MatePad 11.5 2025 version. Now, first things first, uh, you know, once you put the tablet into the case itself, you can actually set it up sort of like a mini laptop and actually do your work on the go, which I mentioned at the start. I know a lot of people actually do their works on their laptops and sometimes they can be quite heavy. So maybe you can actually consider switching to a tablet like this because it's very compact. And again, you actually get that PC like experience. So what I mean by this is, you know, built into the tablet itself, you have this uh, PC level WPS, which if you are actually new to this application, this app is free to use by the way, uh, it's actually very similar to the full suite of Office that you actually use on your computer. That means that you can create your documents, your spreadsheets, your presentations, all directly in the PC level WPS, which actually gives you the full functionality, all the tools, all your fonts and all that. You can also save it in multiple different formats directly from the app itself. So it's very, very convenient to use, especially when you are on the go. I know some people also like to sign documents. You know, these days we have a lot of PDFs to sign as well. And this is also where the M Pencil comes in the mix. Now, other than that, one of my favorite features here is actually split screen. So, you know, sometimes when you're just doing your work, you might want to access other apps, you know, watch your social media, or maybe you just want to reference a website, copy some text and drag across. Well, you can actually do that with split screen. So you can actually drag, just copy and paste text directly from your right window to the left window or vice versa. And that again makes things very seamless and not a lot of tablets can do that, but you can do it directly on the MatePad 11.5. So yeah, the mini laptop experience is real here on this MatePad 11.5 2025. All right, now let's move on. Another favorite feature of mine is definitely in terms of the display at the front. Now, not a lot of tablets actually give you this anti-glare paper matte display that also focuses on eye comfort. You know, the problem today is that we have so many devices and we are staring at them most of the time. So some of you might feel a bit of eye strain in your eyes. Well, the display on here is actually designed to actually counter all that and make it more comfortable for the viewing experience. So it's certified by TV Rhineland as well as SGS. It's got so many certifications which you can see on your screens right now. So this actually allows you to get that more comfortable viewing without so much eye strain, regardless of you using it in the day or at night. But my favorite feature here is it's actually all about the anti-glare. You know, when you actually tilt it from side to side and you have a very strong light source, you notice that all the glare is actually diffused out. So you actually have a very soft, a very nice viewing experience here, regardless of whether you're watching your movies or just doing your work. And also, not to mention, because it's a paper matte display, that means that it's great for writing your notes on. Now this brings me to my next point here and let's talk a bit about Huawei Notes. Now this application has been refreshed and now the Huawei Notes app is probably the most comprehensive notes app that I've ever experienced. You have so many features built into here. You have your resource center, you have so many templates, so many stickers to use, plenty of covers, different kinds of papers, different kinds of pencils and pens. I mean, seriously, there's so many features in Huawei Notes to actually make you go wild and put all your kind of ideas, your brainstorming directly into the tablet itself. In fact, if you want to add in a voice memo, you can also add in voice recordings. And if you feel like your handwriting is too ugly, don't worry, there's also AI handwriting enhancer in here. So yeah, a lot of features in Huawei Notes and you guys should definitely try it out because it's just crazy. All right, so moving on, let's take a look at the device itself because I haven't talked too much about that. So we actually have two colors over here. It's built in this all metal unibody design. It's very lightweight. How lightweight? It's 515 grams. It's also 6.1 millimeter slim, but more impressive is actually the amount of battery you get in here. That's a 10,100 mAh unit. So that means that you're going to be able to go hours and hours with your work as well as the entertainment without having to charge it so often. But if you do need to charge it, it comes with that 40 watt supercharge. That means that you can also fill it up with juice fairly quickly. So all in all, you know, I feel that this is actually the perfect size for me when it comes to a tablet, 11.5 inches, slim, lightweight, it comes with everything, yeah, that's pretty good over there. Now, last but not least, for creators or artists out there, you know, I know a lot of people still like to sketch on their tablets as well, and this is where you actually have the Go Paint professional painting app. Now, just like the PC level WPS, this Go Paint app is also meant for professionals. You have a ton 
of different brushes in there, all kinds of textures, all kinds of papers, and you can put in so many layers that you can really go, you know, really go all out and draw the perfect picture directly on this tablet. So it's pretty cool there. The best part here is that the M Pencil 3rd Gen is almost close to zero latency. So whenever you're just sketching or drawing on the tablet or even writing for that matter, it's almost a one-to-one -one experience similar to what you would get on a pencil and paper. Now, at the end of the day, for RM1599, I think you're getting a lot of value with the Huawei MatePad 11.5. Not only are you getting a compact tablet that's lightweight, that's slim, you have that anti-glare paper matte display that again, if you find on other tablets might be very expensive. You also have a long battery life and you have the complete package together with the keyboard as well as the M Pencil 3rd Gen. All these added together forms this sort of mini laptop PC-like experience. But yeah, if you want to find out more information or if you just want to get one for yourself, check out the official Huawei link down below in the description box. Thank you for watching this video all the way to the end. Hopefully it has helped you out in a way or another and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Do take care, stay productive, bye-bye.